I've been checking out Nobara and Bazite lately, and honestly, they both aim at the same crowd, gamers on Linux, but they go about it in very different ways. Nobara is the distro for people who like having their hands on the steering wheel. It's Fedora-based and made by Glorious Egro, yeah, the Proton G guy, and the whole system is mutable, meaning you can customize it however you want with DNF or other package managers. It comes pre-tuned for gaming with special kernels, up-to-date drivers, and all the codecs you'll ever need. Plus, the Nobara Tweaks tool takes care of some of the annoying stuff automatically, like drive permission fixes. It's great if you want freedom and don't mind tinkering to get things just right. Bazite, on the other hand, feels more like a console. It's also Fedora-based, but this one's immutable, so the core system is locked down for stability. Updates are atomic, which means if something breaks, you can just roll back after a reboot. Super convenient. It ships with Steam Gaming Mode for a living room style UI and is optimized for handhelds like the ROG Ally. On top of that, it comes preloaded with extras like Lutris, Waydroid, and Decky Loader, so you don't have to spend time setting that up. It's basically install and play with minimal fuss. In short, Nobara is DIY and customizable, while Bazite is stable, pre-configured, and console-like.